Mac 2022 and I'm on the stand of Herco. Now a beautiful stand, but the reason that I'm here at the minute is to review the new TMX8M YSI with Keith. Keith, have you had a good show? Yeah, it's been a very busy show, Joe. Yeah, very busy. Yeah. Now, Keith, this looks a lovely looking lathe. The ergonomics look great. The accessibility looks great. But can you give our audience a brief overview of this new lathe? Yeah, OK. It's a, a Y-axis sub-spindle lathe. So we've always had driven tool lathes and two-axis lathes, but this is the next sort of step up, really. And what was this driven by? How did this come about? Well, I suppose it's just the, the next level. Customers have been asking for it for quite a long time and we've been eventually been able to bring it to market. Okay, and this is the launch of it here at Mac 2022? Yes, yes. Um, we've, had, we've had the machine in the UK now probably a couple of months, but this is its first sort of major outing, really, yeah. Okay, let's start with the spindles. What's the bar capacity on the main and second spindle? On, on this model, this is an 8-inch chuck, so the bar capacity on the main spindle is 64 mil, and the sub-spindle is a 6-inch chuck, and the bar capacity there is 45 mil. And again, does this bridge a gap that you didn't have before yeah we, we never had a well we had a y-axis years ago but this is the second generation so y-axis gives us a lot more capability and obviously the sub spindle too and now the, the turret i'm looking at the turret it looks a chunky old turret the duplomatic turret and um, talk us through this driven tool tooling turret um, well it's, it's a 12 station duplomatic turret um, you can have 12 tool space in the main spindle 12 tool space in the sub spindle and every position is a, is a live position. You can have a live tool in any station. And again, I mentioned the ergonomics. The accessibility to this lathe is fantastic, isn't it? Yeah, if you needed to crane anything in, there's plenty of access for craneage, or just li literally lifting the parts in, yeah. This is the eight inch chuck model. There's also a 10 inch chuck model as well. So two different options on yeah. spindle nose configurations yeah, and, bar, and- Bar capacity really, yeah. Yeah, just different sizes on the main and sub spindle chuck. Perfect, so the, the, the through spindle bore is the same but just different chuck options? Um, well the 10 inch spindle bore would be bigger, you'd be 77 mil over three inches there. Right, so yeah, I've got the do two different options yeah, yeah, and now yeah. with, with the control system, the Herco control system, yeah. it, you know you're so successful with this on the VMCs, yeah. um, are you having the same success with, the with, with the lathe? Yeah really, it's still WinMax software uh, the way you program it is exactly the same. You can program it conversational or it'll run full G code. It's, it's the same software that everybody knows and likes really, yeah. And will this be a big success for Herco? I think so, judging by the interest in the week. Yeah, I think it will be very much so, yeah. So there you have it, the new TMXAMYSI. Um, just launched at Mac 2022. To find out more, contact Herco.